All right, Coach. Gotta nail this jump if I'm gonna win gold in the cold vest at the Rocky Talkie Resort. Can this please, please, please be the last time? I have to pack for Hawaii. Copy that. Ready when you are, Shawnee. We're good to go! at yard sales? No, it's what you call a wipeout where everything just goes flying, like what Polly just... Polly! I didn't doubt you for a second. What? I'm serious. Go big! Polly Pie! Yeah, Dad? Time to hit the Rocky Talky Mountains. Oh, hi, Lila. Shawnee? Ooh, loving that ski suit, Mr. P. Rad Dad, all the way. <laughs> Thanks, Lila. Fit me in 1986 and still fits today. <laughs> We're leaving at 20 hunt! Yeah, my plane leaves soon too. <gasps> Gotta pack! I got you covered. A stylish and practical outfit for each event. Oh, at least you two have places to show off your spring break wardrobes. I'm stuck on a staycay. If you think Littleton's dull all school year, just wait until everyone's gone for spring break. <gasps> Consider yourself lucky, Lila. Time at home means you can catch up on movies and books and finish writing that fanfic you've been working on. More like counting down the minutes till you guys get back. Don't worry, we'll be talking tons. I need my fashion coach and my sports coach to survive gold in the cold fest. We'll get you some cool souvenirs, promise. Oh, just remember, jewel tones with my complexion. Thanks. <laughs> Oh yeah! Hope Rocky Talkies prepared for their yearly dose of Pierce Pocket. Yeah, that's something no one can prepare for. I love that this place never changes. I hear you, hun. Watch it! You'll burn your behinds. Grandma, you made it! I promised that I wouldn't miss another trip to Rocky Talkie. There's no time to waste. I want to hit the hot tub, then the skating rink, then the hot tub, then the ice sculpture exhibit, all before a relaxing sunset dip in the hot tub. <laughs> I like the way you think, Pierce. He's so cute. What's his name? Uh, Paxton, my baby brother. Oh, ew. And you're coming with me. Hey, we're practically the same person. Genetics. I need to train for gold in the cold fest. Gotta work out the border cross kinks. I'll join you, Polly. Let's put on our winter duds and hit the powder. Yeah. Fair warning, I've seen some stiff competition around here. That's why I've been having some pocket-sized practice. Every year that we come here, I've watched the gold in the cold fest and dreamed about winning the gold. Now that I'm old enough to compete, I'm gonna give it my all. Shawnee, having fun in the sun? 
just saw two dolphins jump over a sailboat under a rainbow. I'm also having a marvelous time on my couch watching movies with Bonita. We just finished Quacknophobia, the heart-wrenching story of a boy and his fear of ducks. Ooh, I've been meaning to stream that. So, is the coaching staff almost ready for our first practice run? Indeed. Hold it. Show me the threads. Ooh, that's so sizzling. It might melt the snow. Thanks, Lila. Wish me luck. Camera check, mic on. Okay, let's do this. Uh, Grandma? Everything okay? Grandma? I, um... Lila, Shawnee, I'll call you back. Grandma? Uh, wouldn't you rather get some hot chocolate, dear? Sure, Grandma. Let's warm you up. <gasps> the gold in the cold fest trophy! Cool! Wait, is that you? Indeed it is. Two-time champ. But that was a long time ago. I can't believe you didn't tell me. Well, let's just say my last competition wasn't my best. In the first event, my figure skates were twisting and turning, light as a feather. The luge course was extra icy that day, and I was on my game. Then came the final event. The race was close. Brazil Grande and I were neck and neck the whole way, but then... It happened. Somehow my ski caught an edge. A classic yard sale took a big tumble, lost my equipment and the competition. And now, every time I put on my skis, well... Grandma, I had no idea. Sorry, dear. I thought I could get over it. But being at the top of that run with you made it all come back. I've been trying to forget that fall for over 50 years, and yet, sometimes it's all I think about. What went wrong? Don't worry, we'll get you back on the slope soon enough. But first, Coco. Liquid chocolate has solved many a problem. Did you see me wipe out? My equipment flew everywhere. Of course I saw it. Your ski pole nearly pegged me. But it did give me an idea about how we'll finally get that locket. After Polly wipes out and her equipment is spread all over the mountain, <laughs> we'll run down and steal the locket! Gigi, you've done it again! No names! I'm Coach Drizel, and you're Gwendo Forfia. We're from somewhere else. Now, it's time for us to make that pocket girl wipe out! It'll be the biggest and best yard sale of the year! <laughs> more, Gwen, more! <laughs> Sorry about earlier. I was taking a tour down memory lane. All good. Everything okay? Think so, but it's a long story. Whatever you do, please do not tell me you are hiking up a volcano in the most majestic setting on Earth. Okay, I won't. But you are, right? Uh, yeah. So, are you ready, Polly? I hope so, but I didn't get to do a border cross practice run. Grandma was frozen stiff with fear. Turns out she competed in gold in the cold fest, too. Wow! Cool! Not the fear thing, but the gold in the cold fest thing. Go on! But she wiped out. And now, I'm gonna do everything in my power to win this thing for her and restore glory to the Pocket family name. Well, gold is my favorite color, and if you're going to win it, we need to get to work. Absolutely! Whoa! Mom! Watch out! Your feet! Sorry, call you right back. The annual Spring Break Gold in the Gold Fest competition is about to begin. Contestants, please make your way to our first event, Figure Skating! All set, Polly? Yep, feeling pretty good. Hold the phone, literally. Outfit check. Perfection. Copy that, coach. Shawnee, why are you yelling? And what's that sound? You're in a helicopter.
doctor, aren't you? Next, Next up, up, Polly Pocket. Pocket. Double P's, P squared. It's called alliteration, Jack. I'm up, gotta go. You and... can do this! More importantly, how much do the judges love your outfit? <laughs> oh no! Try to regain your balance! Stay low and extend your arms! <gasps> Are you okay? Yeah. Sorry, Grandma. Oh, no worries, sweetie. You'll get him on the next one. <laughs> I fun! I fun! I really fun! <laughs> Be safe, Polly! Yeah, what she said. Safety first. Shawnee, you there? Camera check. Hi! Looks good. How you feeling? I'm okay. I had a big breakfast, and before you ask, yes, it included one of your banana smoothies. And the protein bars I gave you for extra energy? Got them. How are the conditions? I've developed a complex matrix to analyze every variable and possible outcome for your run. According to my stats, riders are having the most trouble with two tricky turns. If you maintain focus, watch your speed, and lean hard into those turns, you should be able to avoid a wipeout and win the race. Thanks, coach. Don't forget to lean! I'm so bored. I painted my nails like 400 times already. Lila, shh! Polly is in the middle of her run! Whoops! Go, Polly! Hey, Lila! Oh, the second turn is coming up, but slow down! You're going too fast! Shawnee, the track was tampered with! That sounds so unfair. Uh-oh. I'm looking at the Rocky Talkie weather report. A big storm is approaching. Ugh, even the weather is against me? Is it weird that even though I should be parasailing over a sunset right now, I'm having more fun hanging with my best friends? Oh, that's the cutest. Aw, Shawnee. But I have to be honest. I don't feel good about this event. Polly Pocket! I've seen footage on every racer here, and you're the best by far. Chin up! Preach on, sister. We know this course inside and out. Every twist and turn, every icy patch to avoid. Combining your skills with my instructions... And my style. We can't be stopped. I'll be there every step of the way to guide you. Now get out there and crush this thing! Let's do it! Whoa! I'm okay! Thanks, Shawnee. <sighs> I feel better. Ish. Storm's blowing in fast. Can I get a status update, Coach? Coach? I need an update here. Shawnee? You there? Lila? Anyone? Hello, Hello gold, gold in the, the cold, cold festers. festers! After the first two events, Gwendo for Fia leads the pack, but there's tight competition for everyone except Polly Pocket. Winner of the name game, but last place in Gold in the Cold Fest, the game that actually matters. Riders, please make your way to the starting line. This one is the main event! The creme de la creme! The big kahuna! The... I need a vacation. Oh, you've had some tough luck, dear. But don't worry, if you win the final event, you still have a shot at a medal. Not the gold one, but a medal nonetheless. I'm in last place, it's storming, and I lost my coach. Oh, what's the use? Sorry, Grandma, but 
I quit. Polly, please, you can't quit. But you did. Maybe this mountain wasn't meant for the Pocket family after all. I don't want you to go down the same road, or in this case, the same hill that I did. Please don't quit. You might regret it for the rest of your life. Fear isn't the answer. I'm not afraid. I'm just... Uh, a little scared of the complete and utter humiliation that awaits. We all have to face our fears eventually. Just trying your best to success in itself. Okay, I'll race, but only under one condition. Borders, take, take your, your marks. marks. Get, Get set! set. Now lean hard into the turn. Thanks, Coach Grandma. Hold on! Woohoo! Great job! The pockets are back on the slopes! What's next? After this straightaway, big right turn. You've got this! Listen closely, Gwen. This is imperative. Make sure Polly is in first when you get to the midpoint of the race. Let's just say she won't know what hit her. Copy. Copy what? I'll have to take that as a yes. Move it, slow border. Don't pay any attention to her. This is your race, Polly. We're gaining on her. No, 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 no! That's not what I want! Grandma, hang on! Out of the way! It's coming right for you! Use the locket, Polly! Great race, honey. You tried your best. I can't believe I lost. I can. Uh, Pax agrees. Hey, cool it, Pierce. Not the time. I'm proud of you, Polly. Even though you didn't win, you did the right thing saving that girl. Thanks, Grandma. You were a pretty stealthy navigator. We'll get him next time. But what was with that snowball? That wasn't some random rogue snowball. Something is going on here. I just can't put my finger on it. What in the name of... I won, Gigi! I really won! No names, Gwen! I said no names! Gwen! Griselle Grande? I knew there was a certain stink in the air. How dare you sabotage this competition? Wait, do you mean sabotage today's competition? Or the one she sabotaged when you were kids? Pardon me, young lady? Yeah, you know, when you were a kid, she sabotaged your race too. And today we sabotage Polly's together. Family tradition. Oh, that was a secret, right? How do you live with yourself? Just fine. I'm a great roommate. You cheated? Yes, I did. But you can't prove a thing. I won and Gwen won. That gold in the cold fest trophy is coming with us. I don't think so, Grizel. Wait! Are you filming this? Every incriminating second. Your ski pass has officially expired. But you can't prove a thing. I want... You can't prove a thing. Cheating? In sports? Well, this just won't be tolerated. Unhand me! This is no way to treat a former Gold in the Cold Fest Grand Champion! Not anymore! We're stripping you of your title! Eight? 
nine, ten. Ha! Huh. Same as the fingers. What do you know? Lila, what's up? Still loving every minute of the staycation? I'm bored. It's terrible. What are you doing? It looks like you're having fun. Oh, nothing. Just a little gourmet picnic by a spectacular waterfall. Please tell me my souvenir isn't one of those silly shirts. <laughs> of course not. But you're a medium, right? <gasps> oh, it's Polly. Let me add her. Hey, I'm on my last run of the day and just wanted to call and say this trip has been really great, but I miss my girls. I miss you both too. Oh, really? So do I. You're never gonna believe what happened. I got Grandma back on the slopes. The competition didn't exactly work out, but I really stepped up on my last run. If there's one thing I learned from Quacknophobia 2 Return of the Quack, it's that winning isn't everything. And ducks love pickles. Anyway, I wanna hear every little detail when you get back. Hurry home, please. Bye. Polly, wait, what size are you? They're gonna love them. Ready, Polly? We'll hit the border cross course one more time, just for fun. Looks like Grandma got her groove back. Hey, wait up, Speedy McSpeedster! Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> now that was a yard sale. The pocket sports gene clearly skipped a generation. 